Okay, so in today's video, we are going to be looking at what an aqua bag really is. Is it a good investment? And also, is it good for basketball players? Because like this is really interesting. Because really, when you think about it, it's the same as idea as a sandbag, except you've got water in it. And guess what? The water moves. So it helps all your stabilizing muscles and tendons and ligaments and all that stuff. So is this a good investment? Let's really check it out. And this is my full review. Okay, so first off, this is how these straps are connected to the bag themselves. As we can see, this is pretty high quality material and this is a cheap bag. This is not the, the big expensive $100 bag or anything. This is just a cheap $50 one in Canada. You can get these for like 30 something bucks in the States and you can get links down below as well. This is like a rubbery material that connects these straps to the bag itself. And we can see when we actually roll the bag over, obviously there is water in there. You, it's hard to really tell, but you can actually see that the, the sewing and the stitching is actually into this plastic stuff itself. Now from there, the seam itself seems to be glued or at least melted together of some kind. Seems to be pretty good. Now, the only thing I've got issues with with this bag, this is a cheap bag. This is not the most expensive $100 bag, but this came with a couple of little dents in the actual plastic already. I'm not too sure if that will weaken it at all. I'm not trusting it yet in my car or in my house. I'm leaving it in my garage, but at least... It's worked so far and it's holding water, it's holding air, it's not having any issues and I've had it for a few days now. So you can actually get these bags in a couple of different sizes. You can get them in this one, which is the two, five, 10, 15, and 20 kilogram bag, which in pounds, I can't remember. I also don't go by kilograms either. Even though I'm Canadian, I do not weigh anything in kilograms. I think it's stupid. I think pounds is the way to go. However, uh, depending on what part of the world you're in, you have a different uh, ID on measurement. And that's totally fine. However, uh, with me, I like pounds. And right now I've got mine set for just under 10. And and I'll probably fill this up to be a bit, a bit heavier in, in a bit. However, what are some things that we can do with this bag? Well, some things are, of course, you can do deadlifts. You want to push that butt out. You want to lift it up. And then you can, ex you can build upon that by bringing it up and then going into a squat. Deadlift into a squat. There's also many other things that you can do as a basketball player. So for example, you can stand with your feet shoulder width apart. You can then go forward, take that lunge and then back, lunge forward and back. And what the water does in here is it really works on stabilizing. Some basic exercises that you can do is literally feet shoulder width apart, shake back and forth. And you can really feel it engage your core. Another exercise that you can do is a lunge forward, starting this at your chest, lunge forward and push and back, lunge forward and push and back. And you really want to keep the water level. That's the whole idea behind an aqua bag is to try and keep the water level. It doesn't matter if it's splashing around. You want to try and keep the same amount of water on each side of the ball or the bag. Something else that you can do as well is it's actually quite comfortable to put behind your head. And usually you don't want to be putting weight behind the head, but this isn't exactly heavy. This is maybe 10, 15, 20 pounds. And you can go into a squat and back up. You can go into a lunge and back up. And it's really, again, working on your stabilizing muscles. And that's extremely important in basketball. Another brand is a DMOC. I don't use their ball, none of the, or the, their bag. This video is not sponsored whatsoever. This is something I paid out of my own pocket for. However, we've seen a DMOC being used by some NBA players, Devin Booker being one of them. So this is something that a lot of basketball players are using. We see this on Instagram, but we do not somehow see this a lot here on YouTube. I'm gonna change that. I'm gonna be making a few more videos with this amazing bag. I feel like this gives you an amazing workout, especially for basketball players. Anyways, I hope that you've enjoyed today's quick video on my review on this bag, some of the exercises I've showed you. And again, I'll see you guys in my next video. You can actually grab this bag down in the description below.